I'm Jelani Remy, and I play Simba in Disney's The Lion King on Broadway. This is amazing. And today, I'm at the Bronx Zoo to learn about the real-life animals that I portray on stage to get a better glimpse at the true meaning of the circle of life. So, Pat, tell us what you do here at the zoo. I'm the general curator and associate director here. And who are these guys behind us? So, these are our, two of our African lions. They are brothers. That's Bahadi and Ime. They're four years old and they were born here. And when fully mature, they could well top 400 pounds. So tell me about this habitat. This exhibit actually opened way back in 1941. And it's significant because it's the first predator-prey exhibit ever built in the United States. We exhibit a predator, in this case lions, alongside prey species. And we try to do it in such a way that the barrier that separates them is not visible to the, the viewer. They're just out there working on their roar. In the beginning of our show, we have a procession of animals coming. Would something like that happen? If prey animals actually can see lions, they'll get fairly close to them because they know they can outrun lions. So they can coexist all together? Within reason. And so what's endangering the lions out in the wild? Well, I mean, they, they face a number of threats. The main threat is loss of habitat. So they're being pushed into smaller and smaller areas where they have to compete with other lions for access to food. The best thing you can do is to become better informed about the threats facing lions. And one way to do that is to go to the Wildlife Conservation Society's website at wcs.org and see what we're doing to help preserve lions and their prey throughout Africa. After seeing these guys, my roar is going to be just as ferocious, if not more. Oh! Oh!